not all mosquitoes are vectors of heartworm. And so currently, uh, to, to take advantage or try to uh, combat heartworm transmission by mosquitoes, we need to have knowledge of the mosquito vector landscape. And when we are developing methods right now to try to target parasites in mosquitoes, uh, and, and the main efforts that we're making currently are trying to um, uh, look at uh, ways to make mosquitoes genetically refractory towards heartworm parasites. And if you think about this, the downstream uh, application of that means that we'll have to have very specific knowledge of what vectors in the local area are, are important for heartworm transmission. And not only that, but those vectors will have to be able to be brought into the lab and genetically manipulated. Uh, and so one uh, possibility to sort of get around some of those uh, um, hurdles is to think about using chemicals to, to block parasite transmission. And this is a pretty wild concept. Not necessarily using chemicals to block, like, to block mosquito transmitted disease. I mean, this is very well established. You just think about insecticides, for example. They've had made a tremendous impact in, in disease burden by mosquitoes. The problem with uh, using insecticides is insecticide resistance, which crops up almost immediately when you start applying it. So our hypothesis is that in the future we'll be able to deworm mosquitoes. So not necessarily kill mosquitoes, but actually kill the parasites within. And I'm hugely heartened by the uh, strategies that have been already put in place in other uh, disease um, and, uh, and other pathogens that mosquitoes transmit. So one very good example would be dengue virus transmission. So in the, in the dengue community, uh, researchers have associated mosquitoes with an insect-specific bacterium called Wolbachia. And Wolbachia stimulates the mosquito's immune response to make it less hospitable to dengue virus. It lowers the disease transmission, and in addition, those bacteria are propagated within the, the local mosquitoes. So that's been hugely successful and that gives us a lot of uh, hope that we'll be able to do something similar in uh, mosquitoes uh, that transmit heartworm. So we've been funded by the Morris Animal Foundation to explore uh, the idea that associated mosquitoes with Wolbachia uh, could stimulate their immune system and prevent heartworm transmission. And we uh, have a lot of preliminary evidence to say that this may be the case. So we were able to associate mosquitoes with Wolbachia and show that they're less capable of supporting the heartworm life cycle. And in other research that we've done, we know that stimulating the mosquito's immune response genetically uh, really potently blocks uh, parasites within the mosquito.